So any extra rain could easily lead to some street flooding here. Uh, so of course, uh, that obviously means that we're expecting some rain later on. But why? With meteorologist Jessica Fernandez. Good Thursday morning, South Florida. Right now, we're starting off with pretty cloudy conditions across Broward and Miami-Dade counties. We do have some light showers across Miami-Dade, especially in the north uh, of, that, of that county. And as we look at your Florida Keys, you're mainly dry except for down in Marathon, where we are dealing with some uh, pretty heavy showers moving on through in between Marathon and Duck Key at this time. We still have a flood watch in effect through this evening until about 7 p.m. Remember that the ground is already saturated from all that rain that we've been seeing. So any extra rain could easily lead to some street flooding here. Uh, so of course, uh, that obviously means that we're expecting some rain later on today. So make sure that you grab your umbrellas on your way out, even though it's not necessarily raining right now in the majority of, of our area. Here are your temperatures right now. It's very warm and muggy, just sort of sticky. As soon as you head out the door, we're already at 78 degrees in Fort Lauderdale and 77 in Miami, Key Largo, you're already waking up to the 80s. Key West, you're at 79. Your dew points are in the 70s once again here. So, of course, that just means just some very muggy and humid conditions. So, what can we expect for today? As Ada moves across northern Florida, we could expect some gusty showers throughout the day today. Also, some pretty windy conditions out there. But then, as we head into tomorrow, Ada is going to be swept away by a cold front, leading to much drier conditions tomorrow. Just some spotty showers only. And by the weekend, it's looking really nice out there. Mostly sunny conditions with just uh, some dotted showers. In the tropics, we've got Theta in the eastern Atlantic. We don't have to worry about that here in the U.S. We have a tropical wave in the Caribbean with about a 90% chance of developing over the weekend. And of course, Ada, which we've been talking about, which by tomorrow, especially into the weekend, won't be an issue for the state of Florida anymore. Here is your marine forecast. We have a small craft advisory in effect. High risk of rip currents at the beaches. Tidal flood for the upper keys this morning and of course your next high tide in key west 7 23 a.m so throughout the day today gusty showers mainly cloudy your temperature slightly above average for this time of year so still some rain but that rain trend is, is going to be trending down as we head into later on tonight partly cloudy just some spotty showers that's going to be pretty much the same as we head into the rest of the weekend becoming much drier and we'll be talking about a cold front as we head into midweek next week that's your seven on seven